What do you think? Were they cut outs or...? Those were cut outs, yes, yes. but this wasn't. This last one. That, that Francis one. said that's genuine. So, to her death, she said that was a genuine She said genuine, because what happened was Elsie um, cut out the others and they put hat pins in them, they stuck them in grasses and on trees. In 1920, with the Condor cameras, they took two more, which Elsie had prepared. Yes. But then it took so such a short time to take the photographs that Aunt Polly said, you have to go and try and get some more because these men have gone to a lot of expense and trouble. So they had to go back again. So they didn't go in the glen, they went above the glen, to the field above the glen yeah. where there's a reservoir. And they're sitting there talking. And then my mother saw, this was three years later, my mother saw, um, she saw uh, things beginning to appear in the grass, like misty, misty objects. And without thinking, she had the camera on her knee, without thinking, she took out the camera, that one there, yes. and she pulled out the lens and judged it to be three feet away, and she snapped it. And when that negative went back to London, they couldn't see what was on it, but they strengthened the images. And from, the, from that negative, they're able to bring out five right. fairy right. figures. So, and she said that's genuine. So to her death, she said, this is a real it's fairy figure. It's genuine, yes, genuine. What yes. do you think? Do you think it is? I do, yes. And you do? Yes. Well, I'm not going to argue. So we might be looking at the only known photograph of real fairies. Yes. The others are a fake. This is the real thing. And they're so now, different. They're so different. Those are solid images. These yes. you can actually see through You can them. see the difference. You see the glasses yeah. behind and yeah. in front. And those are hairbells. They're so tiny, you know. So those and the camera are the absolute original yes. material. Yes. I think it's... I'm just holding this camera, <laughs> you know. Now, what we've got here is something that is extremely rare. I mean, this as a camera is worth 20 or 30 pounds in pure camera terms. It's nothing. It's nothing special at all. Add that story, this is all going to be 25, 30,000 pounds. Who knows? Out there, there are fanatical collectors. It's not the camera, it's the images. These are the key. And it's just extraordinary, as I say, to be in touch with this magic moment. Actually, I'm beginning to believe it myself. <laughs> you know, I started by saying, do I believe in fairies? Perhaps I do. Thank you. Thank you.